Let's balance the chemical equation for C8H18 plus O2. This is octane and we have oxygen gas. So first off, the type of reaction here, this is a combustion reaction. That's because we have carbons and hydrogens here bonded together. We're adding them to oxygen and we're getting carbon dioxide and water. So this is a combustion reaction. That's the type of reaction. To balance the equation, first we need to count up all the atoms. That'll look like this. Really the thing you need to be careful for is we have two oxygens here and then one here. So two plus one gives us three. So make sure that you get that correct starting out. When we balance combustion reactions, we want to leave the oxygen here until last. That's a really good strategy because if we change the coefficient in front of oxygen, that really won't change the carbons or hydrogens. So oxygen goes last for combustion reactions. Let's do carbon. We could put an eight as our coefficient, one times eight. Balances the carbons. Let's update the oxygens. So we have two times eight, that's 16, plus the one here in water. Now we have 17. Let's just put a nine in front of the water. Two times nine, that'll give us 18. So the hydrogens are balanced. Let's update the oxygens. Eight times two, that's 16, plus nine times one, that's nine. So we get 25 oxygen atoms, which is a little bit of a problem. You can think of it this way. We need to have 25 oxygens over on this side of the equation to balance our equation. So two times something, that would equal 25. Two times 25 over two, the twos would cancel out, that works. So we could put a coefficient of 25 over two in front of the oxygen. In this equation, it's balanced. What's most important is that we have the correct ratio, and this is the right ratio for C8H18 plus O2. Some teachers, they want to have whole numbers. If we want to do that, we can multiply everything by two. We'll still have the same ratio, but then we'll have whole numbers. That'll look like this. So these are also the correct coefficients for C8H18 plus O2, this octane plus oxygen gas. If we were to write the states, they'd look like this. Octane is a liquid, oxygen is a gas, carbon dioxide is a gas, and since this is a combustion reaction, it would be exothermic, it'd be hot, and water would be a gas, at least initially. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for C8H18 plus O2 and the type of reaction, which is combustion. Thanks for watching.